Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, what's up? Welcome to my channel, I'm Vicky. How are you doing? This is a homeware haul and I just recently moved. So I am trying to make my house look cool. Um, I'm still getting furniture and things like that, but I just I just wanted to like get into the mood. I mean, I have furniture. I just I want new furniture. So I went to IKEA Container Store and Home Goods and uh, got a couple things. Not a couple, a lot. Ugh, this bag is heavy. Most of this stuff is random, but it's okay because it is impossible to go to IKEA without buying random things you don't need. So I got these drawer organizers. These were three dollars, I think, and they're just like plastic drawer organizers. And what I like about these is that they're a little deeper than the ones that I got from Walmart. I figured you can never have enough drawer organization because all of your drawers need to be organized. Uh, and they were only three bucks, so why not? Little plant holder pot things. These are 45 cents. For 45 cents? Are you kidding me? Why not? Why not get three? You know, I got some fake plants and because I love foliage. I just feel like you need plants. Um, this is actually supposed to be downstairs in the kitchen, but I put this in here just to make this look cute for a video I was doing. So I was like, okay, I need some more plants because I don't have any plants upstairs. I got two of these. Okay, so you just put them in your little, see? See how cute and easy that is? You know, put that back there. I'll show you. This one is from Target, by the way. It was 20 bucks. And this is from Ikea. The plant was $3 and this was 45 cents. So this is a $4 plant compared to a $20 plant. I mean, come on. I mean, I don't know, it just makes things look so put together. And just put it in there. I got my plants. You know, I won't leave all of them back there. I'm probably gonna move that middle one, take it somewhere else. But I like having a lot of plants around. It just makes the house look lively. And I got this plant tray and I think I'm gonna use this for my makeup brushes because what I find, hello, hello, hello. I have a lot of brushes and I don't like putting them in separate containers and last time I got a big old bowl and put some rocks in it and I dropped the bowl, I got the rocks all over the floor and it took me forever to clean up. So I figured I would just get a big old uh, plant tray, put my brushes in here and that was I think $9 I wanna say. It's kind of, I feel like that's kind of pricey compared to the other plant holders that they have that are so much cheaper, but whatever. This is a big storage thing. I don't know. Um, I'm not necessarily sure what it's called, but I'm going to use it to store makeup in. I was gonna hide like miscellaneous stuff in here. I'm thinking I'm gonna put my makeup palettes in here, even though I don't have a ton of palettes, and this thing is kind of big. I didn't notice how big it was until I brought it home. And I was like, oh. This thing is kind of big. It's called Palra, the Palra. And this was $14. And it's got these, oh, it's upside down. It's got these drawers in it. Um, and the drawers are pretty deep. So you can put, you can put a good amount of stuff in here. Uh, I also got another one of these drawers for my big shelf from Ikea that I have. Um, I have the big Kallax, it's called Kallax Shelf and I like put some of my knickknacks and stuff on there just like put on display. It's a room divider right now, but I think I'm gonna move it up against the wall. I don't know yet. I'm still configuring my space. Um, but I got another one of these because I only got three of them. I don't know why. I should have got four. Um, but I got another one of these. This thing actually holds a lot of stuff. I put all my hair products in these. So on the bottom row of my shelf, I have all my hair products. Um, and I keep all my wigs and my hair products in there. So I got another one. This one will probably hold like my wig head and some more wigs. I know, I, too many hair products and too much hair stuff, which is funny because I ain't got no hair. So what am I doing with all this stuff? <laughs> and then I wanted to try this um, sparkling pear drink. It's literally just pear juice, sparkling pear juice, but I wanted to try it because uh, it was only $2. So I figured why not? So, um, yeah, that's the stuff I got from IKEA. Moving on to Home Goods and Container Store. So first thing I got from Home Goods was this thing over here, and I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. This is a filing cabinet that I got from Home Goods. It has wheels on it, and it's got like a mint blue color. It's really cute. It was 80 bucks compared to $150, which is what 
is the usual price, I was like, okay, that is definitely something that I'm gonna have to get because it's way cheaper than the ones I was looking at online. So I got it and it's gonna be functional. It's gonna store my most used stuff so that I can move it around whenever I do my makeup and film. I can move to different parts of the room and I'm not in the way. And then when I wanna put my makeup away, it's all in there. It looks discreet. Nobody knows what that is. It's just cute. Other things I got from Home Goods, I also got this really cute vase. Doesn't this look like a $40 vase? Guys, it was only $6. $6. And that's not even marked down. That's like regular price. Who knew? It's like a big bubble. And I love bubbles. So right now I have this blue vase in here, which is also for home goods, but my mother-in-law got that for me. For got that from got got that from my mother-in-law. Um, but it doesn't go with my color scheme in here, which I don't know what the color scheme is yet, but it ain't blue. I just had that in there filling up space because I needed something to go in there. Please disregard the fact that there's a mirror back there. I don't know why that's back there, I just put it there. I think I'm gonna put this down there. Look at it. Okay, you can't see it, but moving on. Um, so that's one bag. What else is in here? I got this random gold journal, but it was only $5. I used to journal. I needed to start journaling again because it's a great way for me to let off steam. It's just a blank journal, nothing in there. Um, but I just thought it was a pretty, so I got it. And then I also got another random item. This is a little bowl and this was this was ten dollars but it's really pretty on the inside. I got this to hold something. My home goods trip was really random. I didn't even plan on going in there. But Home Goods has my heart, so I just, I had to go. I went to Container Store for a specific reason and I came out with more than what I bargained for, but it's okay because we got what we needed and a little more. I really needed some of these. These are, it's just a two-tier bathroom organizer thing. It goes under the sink. Like I have a lot of skincare products and know where to put them. So I'm going to be putting them in here. I got two of these to go under my sink. And then I got a trash can in rose gold because rose gold is just, it's amazing. But I also got another trash can and these trash cans were only $10 I think. So that's a good deal to me for this big old trash can. This is a big trash can. Um, this one is going in my bathroom. That's all the things that I got. So I hope that you guys enjoyed my little haul, my homeware haul. Like this video if you wanna see more homeware hauls and I will do them for you. I will let you guys in on my little home shopping experiences. Um, but that's pretty much it. My home is a work in progress, guys, so I know you guys probably wanna see like a home tour and all this stuff like that. I'm not gonna do a home tour because it's gonna take me forever to furnish my home, but once I do finish this area where I film, I will be doing a tour of that. Um, so yeah, you guys stay tuned and I will be sure to do that for you. So uh, thank you guys for watching and I'll talk to you guys in my next video, okay? Bye.